Hey, what's up everybody? Noah here for Adafruit. So Facebook recently added reactions to the like button feature. These are some pretty cute emojis. A lot of people seem to like it. Some folks think it's overdue and others are still hoping for that dislike button. With all the media coverage hyping this up, this got us thinking, why not make a physical like button? This is the physical like button. You press the button and the number counter gets displayed on the LED screen. I know this looks a lot like a novelty product, but this can actually be used for all sorts of useful things. Let's say you want to keep track of attendees in an event, or keep track of that score for a game, or really anything else that needs a tally counter. Now the really cool thing about this is that you can build your own with just a few components and a 3D printed case. To make your own, you'll just need a couple parts, an Adafruit trinket, a seven segment LED display, and an arcade button. You're also gonna need some handy tools like a soldering iron, and access to a 3D printer. Now, if you don't have access to the 3D printer, definitely check out a service like 3dhubs.com and they'll ship it out to you. First, we'll start off with uploading the sketch to the Adafruit Trinket using the Arduino IDE. You'll need a couple of libraries and the Adafruit AVR hardware. Definitely recommend referencing our circuit diagram to wire up the components. You can check out our full tutorial linked below at the Adafruit Learning System. Now we really like these arcade buttons because they have this low profile and they're pretty easy to take apart. Now to make it glow, we fitted an LED sequin to some 3D printed parts and replaced the stock cover with a little cute emoji heart. We also made a thumbs up version and that's more just to sort of match that Facebook theme, but this can be any emoji that you want. Now the whole thing is powered through this micro USB cable, but you can easily upgrade this with a battery pack or a lithium polymer battery to make it portable. The design files and the Arduino code are totally open source, so you're free to customize this and make it fit whatever project ideas you might have. That's it for this one, folks. Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you like this project, be sure to hit that virtual like button. And if you want to see more project ideas, check out all of our playlists. They're linked all over the place. And of course, don't forget to subscribe for more 3D printing projects from Adafruit. But until next time, I will see you guys later. Look how many likes we have. Fake likes. <laughs>